Well, do you sometimes feel sad? You feel like crying? Boo hoo. You do? All right, come on. Let's cry. Let's have a cry. Boo hoo. If you're sad and you know it, cry. Boo hoo. Boo. If you're sad and you know it, cry. Boo hoo. <laughs> if you're sad and you know it, then you really ought to show it. If you're sad and you know it, cry. Boo. <laughs> Sometimes, if you're sad, it helps to cuddle a nice, soft toy. Oh, and then you feel happier when you do that. Oh, well, I'm feeling much happier now. And I feel like clapping my hands. You clap too. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. Yes. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, then you really ought to show it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. Well, I'm feeling really happy now. All right, there you go, little Ted. Back to feeling so happy, I think I'll have a uh, a jump around. You jump. If you're happy and you know we jump around, jump! Oh, if you're happy and you know we jump around, jumping! If you're happy and you know it, then you really ought to show it. If you're happy and you know we jump around, oh, so happy and so tired. Oh, I'm so tired. I think I'll have to have a little rest. Can I have a rest too. If you're happy. And you're tired, have a rest. If you're tired and you know it, have a rest. If you're tired and you know it, then you really ought to show it. If you're tired and you know it, have a rest. All right, and have a stretch now. Oh, it was a nice rest, wasn't it? Well, there's someone who gets tired in the story today, but before the story, tick tock tick. Well, the tall hand is pointing straight up, and the short hand is pointing to the two, so it's two o'clock on the rocket clock, and stand by for blast off. Five, four, three, two, one, zero, blast off. <laughs> What's underneath the rocket today? Ah, ah, there's a watering can and cat in a wheelbarrow. Hmm. The story today is about Tom. And there's Tom with his toy monkey, Pippo. And there in a wheelbarrow. Now, Tom is talking in this story, and this is what Tom says. I often take Pippo into the garden. He likes to ride in my wheelbarrow. I take Pippo around the paths. Bump, 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 bump. Pippo likes to be bumped. And there's Pippo. Can you see he's in the wheelbarrow? And can you see there's a, a cat hiding, hiding in the garden there behind the pot plant? When we've had enough, I give Pippo his dinner. Can you see Tom's feeding Pippo some sand from a bucket? Just pretend dinner. Pippo makes a mess when he eats. He gets food all over his face. So I have to wipe him with a flannel. When I hear Mum calling, I make a little bed for Pippo so he can have a sleep while I eat my lunch. Now, where's that cat hiding? Mm, ah, there she is. 
right up in the top of the tree. <laughs> After lunch, when we want to play, that cat is asleep in my wheelbarrow. We have to shoo him out. Shoo, 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 shoo. And then round and round the garden, we play until it's time to go in for tea. And there, there's Tom feeding Pippo a biscuit. Yum. And that's the end of the story. Mm. Time for tea. A cup of tea. Oh, yum. From a teapot. You ready to be a teapot? Like this? All right, arms down. I'm a little teapot, short and stout. Here is my handle, here is my spout. When I get all steamed up, then I shout. Tip me over, pour me out. One more cup? All right. Here we go. I'm a little teapot, short and stout. Here is my handle, here is my spout. When I get all steamed up, then I shout. Tip me over, pour me out. Oh. oh, more teapots. I'm a little teapot, short and stout. Here is my handle, here is my spout. When I get all themed up, then I shout. Tip me over, pour me out. More tea, please. I'm a little teapot, short and stout. Here is my handle, here is my spout. When I get all themed up, then I shout. Tip me over, pour me out.